Yeah. Well, uh, yeah, we got, um, I guess we're in the middle of kids' movies season all of a sudden. Oh, yeah, dude, I'm so glad we are because if we weren't, the, after the last thing we watched, I would say, you know, I'm traumatized after what was it, Trash City or whatever it was called? With trash. Oh, yeah. Street, street, street Trash. Street trash. Or, right. Yeah. After that, I'm a little traumatized. I'm so happy we're watching a child's film. Let's do this. Yeah, we might. You guys might not see trash, uh, street trash for a while, if at all. Yeah, y'all should ever. watch it. No, honestly, I want to personally recommend to never watch that film. Well, I just say, like, I want to make a we watch of it, but uh, that would be difficult. I want that too, but the amount of editing <laughs> yeah. that needs to be involved, of, I mean, uh, the whole thing was. Uh, Maybe I'll save that for fire. like. Uh, maybe I'll save that for if we ever get like <laughs> Patreon members or something down the Dude, line. Th- that's a Patreon moment, is what that oh, is. Boy. All right. All right. Well, let's, let's watch Space roll. Camp, starring um, Leah Thompson from Howard the Duck and Back to the Future, and um, Kelly Preston, uh, John Travolta's hot wife who passed away. Mm. Um, and I think the main reason why we picked this movie is because it's allowed on YouTube. <laughs> so. Well, we're gonna find out. You all, all you told me is that children are launched into space or something. Right, right. And it's I, a space disaster film starring kids. So, and and I, got, I, I'm, I'm, dude, I, I've got a good feeling. That's a real, yeah. uh, that's a real uh, plastic logo they had built and filmed. That wasn't a, that wasn't like a computer stuff. <laughs> that's pretty cool. What, 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 what year is this movie from? Um, actually, let's talk about this that. This is funny. This is the same year the Challenger exploded. <laughs> so. <laughs> they, they, they had to push the fucking making the release of this back. No, oh, Kate Capshaw. No, Kate, but what year? Uh, eighty year. something. Uh, eighty six. Uh, eighty six. Yeah. That's the year I was um, born. Birthed yeah, out Kate. of the fucking womb. I was fooped out of the womb, dude. Foot out of the womb. Kate Capshaw was uh, Steven Spielberg's wife. Uh, she was in uh, uh, Temple of Doom. Leaf Phoenix. Oh my God! You know who that is? That's Joaquin Phoenix in, in his first role ever when he was named Leaf. Tom Skerritt's in this? Holy shit. This is a lot of star, uh, star, uh, oh, star appeal. Get it? Stars in By front of By the way, that's, this, <laughs> these, are, these are not real images of space. No. FYI. No, no. no. This is, they got one no. of those uh, air, air uh, spray paint painters on the street. <laughs> to make this. No, I mean, you can see the little dots, like, uh, in relation, but, like. They're little layers. Oh, John Williams! Like, Music by John but, Williams? What the fuck? That, that was insane. Is this a Steven Spielberg movie that we don't know about? <laughs> this is the one they wanted everyone to forget about. Um, He's going to be just recycling his old music from other movies, I bet. He tends to do that. Um, He also is captured. He's also, like, stolen music from ancient composers, if you watch those videos. Oh, well, yeah. You call it stolen. I call it uh, paying I mean, homage. I call it being influenced by... You call it rebranding. W.W. W. Wicket and Casey T. Mitchell presenting a story by Patrick Bailey. And Harry, Harry Wiener. No, <laughs> sorry. My bad. Sorry, my bad. Harry Wiener. Oh, we even got the Star Wars, the Star Harry, Wars Harry Panda. Wiener. Yeah, yeah, that's what you Harry Wiener. You got a Star Wars pan down. <laughs> when I was a little girl, I wanted to be an astronaut, and my father and mother beat me. Don't you know snakes live in those yeah. places? They got some fucking snakes all over that place. That's exactly what the moon looks like. The moon used to look very different 40 years ago. People don't realize that. Yeah, people don't know that that's literally what it used to look like. It was a lot bigger and uh, a lot more shading. He winked at me. He winked. John Glenn winked at me. John Glenn? Who the fuck is John Glenn? An astronaut. She's delish. She's got some delusional stuff going on. Look at that crazy look in her eyes. I'm that chick's up. A, that, that, what? Who fed that little girl acid? Why would you want to be, um, yeah, like, I want, my dream is to go float up in space away from all these assholes. Who's <laughs> dosing this child? That's what I want to know. Hi, darling. There she is, Kate Capshaw. Looking good. Hell yeah. I can't believe it. They chose she looks good as a brunette. Of me. He gets air sick in cars. That's why I married you instead of Eddie Miller. I thought for sure I was getting up there this time. Oh, it's because she's a woman. NASA's being all sexist. They'd rather have a fly. They'd rather have a man than a that gets flight sick. 
than a, uh, a woman. Think of the bright side of this one. You get to spend your summer with me at space camp. Oh, no. You promised. Women should be allowed in space because there are no bears in space, so... Pretend I'm an astronaut with a bears? Yeah, so they'll be safe when their red flowers blooming. What the fuck? You know how they tell you not to bring women f fucking camping because their periods attract bears? That was a joke, I told you. Is that true? Is that yes! true, though? Of course! That's a fact? Yeah, same thing with in really? the ocean. In the ocean, you can't go swimming on your well, period because you're fucking with the sharks. Yeah. Well, it's the same like thing. Bears? Same thing with bears, dude. <laughs> they'll oh, come. shit. They'll also come if you have food, you know, like outside of your. You Damn, keep... dude. There should be a product for that. This is some good music. How to, like, like, mask your cooter scent? During bear season. Oh my something. god, it's the little black kid from Revenge of the Nerds. You imagine a rocket deploying from that, re like, close to a building? No, this is like a kid's, uh, kid's space camp. I know, but they better not take off in that rocket, because if they do, that's the most insane thing ever. That building would be destroyed instantaneously. Great boosters. Would you say for my <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what he said. Great hey, boosters. Yeah, that was smooth, wasn't it, Rob? Hey, would you not hit on my wife, please? Okay, okay. Hey, remember you used to do that? Remember you'd be like, hey, nice tits, remember? I still do. What are you talking about? I know, I do. Remember that? Great titties. I'm like, dude, that's my wife. <laughs> You're like, nice tits. <laughs> You did that. That was hilarious. Yeah, right. And she's like, oh, Enzo. Because <laughs> they were nice. She knew it. And they Everyone were nice. It, it was a genuine compliment. It was a genuine compliment. I agreed. It was just funny. You know, like, you're just like, no fucks given. Nice test. <laughs> I like how he turned his music back up. I just told you to turn it down. That's a crappy looking spacecraft, I tell you. So he just moved from one parking spot to another? <laughs> yeah, dude, he's gotta relocate. You can't park in the official spot. This parking is for astronauts only. Oh. Party's over. Yeah, as soon as people spend less of off, no more muse. No more muse, dude. There she is! Little Leah Thompson! God, what a, what a... What a show off having to show up to space camp in your own little private airplane. Yeah, what a fucking. You are real I don't know, dude. That would just be off. <laughs> You're a real astronaut. Astronaut, dude. <laughs> What'd you call me? Hideo Takamini. Isn't it? Takamini! Gonna... Is that because of my haircut? Free condoms? What? Oh, uh, we got teams. I want to be on the purple team. Okay, on purple team. Yeah, he's gonna. She's gonna lie. So he's gonna pretend that his name's Hideo the whole movie. Apparently, I'm Japanese, bro. What of it? That he's going to be Japanese now? I would not feel safe, safe standing under giant rocket boosters like that. I know they're not. I know the likelihood of them turning on is like zero, but still. But can you imagine? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there she is, Kelly Preston. Oh, wow. She's like the babe of the group, obviously, with her hair all teased and How do you feathered. even make your hair do that? I just don't even know how you make your hair do that. Um, genetics part of it, and then a lot it? of curlers and hairspray. Not this guy's hair, not her hair. This other chick next to him. <laughs> is this a dude from... No, that's not. That's I thought it Geeks. was Lamar. Yeah, is it? The little gay yeah, dude from Revenge of the, the, the Nerds. Yeah, that's him, right? Yeah, I think so. It's gotta be. Dude, that's what I was thinking. The guy who throws the javelin. Right. It's him, right? Wow, yes. thanks, man. You know, my father told me that when you come to space camp, we give you all kind of different... We'll talk about later. Rudy, shut up. Stop trying to get free oh, handouts all the time. It's not? Shit. You can call me Andy, and you can sleep with me if you want, if you're good, if you know how to, if you know what you're doing, if you got game. <laughs> Tish Ambrose. What is Tish short for? 
did this um, radio astronomy. It was unbelievable. Uh, Can you imagine? So she's like the Kelly Tisha? Preston. Tisha? Uh, no, Trisha. You're thinking of that name. That's a normal name. Uh, the, the, Trish is a normal name. Tish? What about Tish? Mm. It's short for Natisha. I don't know. Ah, <laughs> uh, that would make more sense. I don't know. Natish- that was the closest thing I could think, you know. We well, I just made that sense. name up, so I hope that's not it. I'm pretty sure that's the name. Natasha is. Why would oh, it's Letitia. Her name's Letitia. That's what it is. Uh, <laughs> there he is. That's Joaquin Phoenix. No, it ain't. Academy Award winner. See his little hair lip? He's unrecognizable. The Joker. <laughs> He's gonna screw Fire. up. Copy Rogue Leader, Star Wars. Hideo Takamini. Hideo Takamini? Right here. Hideo Takamini? Hi. Well, actually, it's pronounced Kevin Donaldson. I don't have a Donaldson. Well, I have one now. Me and Hideo traded places. Wait, so far off from his name? <laughs> she just let it slide. Actually, I was thinking more along the lines of mission regent or um, sovereign, maybe? Something like that. Edison. Bomber? I don't know. I don't know anything. I don't know. Give me something. I want to be head of security, like Worf. I want to do cavity searches. First female shuttle commander. You think that's more important than pilot? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, Tingley's just so thinking like, of getting a promotion. Like, uh, she goes, oh, yeah. <laughs> she's like breathing heavy and biting her lip. Did you see that shit? Yeah, I did. She was like way too into that. The the idea of power gets her off. This is exactly why you shouldn't be shuttle commander. You fucking. She's gonna go on. She's gonna get on a power trip. It's a what? She's gonna be on a power trip. Why is everyone's short so little? It's the eighties, bro. It's the eighties. Yeah, there was, was. Yeah, there were short uh, shortages, so you had to uh, <laughs> make the shorts shorter. I don't fucking know. Oh, I mean, this Dude, like their the teacher's the hottest one, one, honestly. Kate Capshaw, I totally get it now, Steven Spielberg. Simulator. Why you married her? Is that what is that what happened? Yeah, they did. She's the annoying chick from Temple of Doom, remember? Nah. Which one? The blonde one who doesn't want to eat the monkey brains and puts her hand in the fucking this spiders. This chick here? The brunette on the right, yes. The curly hair. The teacher. Her. Look at this her. Chick? Oh, shit. Oh, d- dude. I didn't even make that connection for some reason. Anyway, I'm not interested in any of this. I'm going over here. <laughs> okay. Boring. Break it. Don't put your hands on that merchandise, chump. Prototype meeting it destroyed. NASA built them for the space station. They don't exist. What's going on? He's not. They blew it on his shielding. His chips become unpredictable in about two hours. He's such a complex piece of machinery. NASA hasn't been able to iron out. Oh, oh is this? Where are you? It's the little robot sidekick. He's coming along the adventure, I bet. I'm uh, off to kill. Uh, <laughs> he's become murder, sentient murder, again. No. Yeah, he's going to just beat this, this guy in the head. Must the use this is. to <laughs> bludgeon. Exterminate. <laughs> must bludgeon. <laughs> Mechanic. Up to next murder. I love, I love murder by. Yeah, I'm in love with him. <laughs> Only, That's my friend. I'm, I'm the only one that relates to Murderbot. I want to kill too. You can help me with you keep my sounding, mission. You keep sounding all muffled. I don't know what's going on. No, I sound muffled. Yes. Right been, now? Not anymore. 
What keep, the dig? Keep your microphone oh. wherever the hell it is now. Stop moving it. It's, I haven't moved it at all. I haven't well, moved it at all. You're clear now. I think you're... Woo, look, think, she's got big old boobies. Oh. No, she don't. Kelly Preston? Dude, I'll show you a, I'll show you a video. Don't you dare. Mischief. She gets real naked in that movie. It's so crazy these these are haircuts that uh that you see from these days. Like, I, I have a feeling it. some of them are gonna come back at some point. What the hell is going on with that person's hat and their hat? Ooh, Look how a, much hair! Look how much hair is yeah. coming out of that hat. Right. It's cousin it. Right. This is like the girls' bunks, huh? All these chicks are aspiring astronauts, huh? I'll be damned. Yeah, these chicks definitely need to go to space. She's got... She's got total recall. It's a real drag sometimes. My mind gets totally cleathered. But they read like really bad erotic novels. Wow. You ever like talk about anything aside from learning things? So we thought she was gonna be a big ditzy dummy because she's pretty. But she's like like Rain Man. Yeah. She's retarded basically. <laughs> she's got the tisms. It's okay. Look at her. Oh, this song. This song is how every movie should end. Yeah, I know this song. I don't know who it is, but I know this song. It's Dire Straits. Is it? Yep. The, this is Dire Straits. Yes, and the song is no. called Walk of Life. There you go. This is Dire Straits? Yeah, dude. I want my MTV, Dire yeah. Straits. Yep. Wow. Is this allowed? Um, seems like they kind of don't search any of these girls. <laughs> They're bringing all kinds of contraband in here. Yeah. You know what this movie needs in the background? Dire Straits. <laughs> in the scene for some reason. I don't know why. I think... I think this whole concept so far is pretty fascinating, but, um... Well, I know this is a real thing. Space camp, right? Why does it look like that guy's holding a dildo? Because you're what a dirty brain. You're a dirty bird. Yeah. I don't know. Big Mac attack. So, so, uh, that's why you're here. Yeah. <laughs> I'm here to fuck some bitches. I'm here to be the first gay man in space. I'm here to fuck some bitches. I want to be the first motherfucker to fuck someone in space. Hell no. Oh. Can I ask me if I'm any good at That's so hot, huh? Some things I just can't figure out. Up. This is I mean, racist. Like, like, I mean, I would want to, like, have sex in space. That sounds so fucking fascinating. Well, you know, <laughs> they'll never disclose who the first uh, people to have sex Dude, in space I, were. it has to have happened. It was two dudes, for sure. And that's why they're never going to tell you who the first people what? to have sex in. Yeah. Oh, right, really? Because you think okay. they would have bragged about it by now. Oh, the first sex couple right here. If these people were the first astronauts to have sex. <laughs> but instead, you're going to find out it was Buzz Aldrin and Neil Armstrong. And you're like, <laughs> um, don't like that. That's a stain on America's. Uh, I mean, I wouldn't be mad. I just like, I just want to know. It's a deleted like, scene from Apollo go. 13 where all those guys thought they were gonna die, so they just fucked each other for a night, and then they were like, "All right, let's get back at it." God, God damn it! Tom Hanks, and Bill just, Paxton, just, Kevin Bacon all blowing each other in the shuttle because they think they're oh, gonna shit. die. Yeah, that's fucked up, man. But you know, you're making a good point. They probably did was two dudes. I'm going to see what everything means from now on in a stupid voice. Okay, get down. <laughs> get down, boogie. Get down on it. Oh, God. Ew, he's pooping. Whoa. He excretes. I am excreting. How does this kid, how come this kid's the only one that knows about the droid? Don't do that. Shaking, shaking legs. Hey, Jinx, move over here, buddy. Right, Jinx. Wrap the thing. Come on. 
You're torturing Do him. Work. Leave Jinx alone. Hey, hey, hey. You're confusing him. He's frightened now. Yeah, y'all broke it. Yeah, the party's ruined. Yeah, we kind of broke a million dollar droid. Your fucking droid <laughs> sucks, bro. We're out of here. NASA might be a little upset that they're... Detonation in T. Yeah. Minus. <laughs> Self-destructing. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, this would be hilarious, actually. I can only wish. Just blows up in Joaquin Phoenix's hands. Ah! Dude, there's been several movies where, like, I'd say something like, oh, wouldn't yeah. it be funny if this happened? And, and then it does. And yeah. then it does. Like, there was a, a, a Jackie Chan movie where it was, like, two hours of buildup. And then I was like, wouldn't it be funny if he walked out these doors and got, like, gunned down by a bunch of machine guns and it was, like, the end? And he burst through the doors and he gets gunned down by a bunch of machine guns and it was, like, the end. And I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> Um, but, like, that happens all the time with shit like this. Let's see. Dude, this kid's an engineer and shit. Jackie Chan's actually died in a bunch of movies. Yeah, but that one, I, I think, I want to call it, I think it was one of the Fist of Furies, maybe. New Fist of Fury. Shot in the chest repeatedly by Japanese soldiers as he leads the Chinese martial arts students in a show that's of resistance. Is, that's yeah. exactly the one, yeah. Wow, you found that fast as hell. I just have all of Jackie Chan's uh, deaths memorized. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I fixed it. Pay me. You just, I'm going no, to send, have send NASA an you're invoice. Like, you're like, I just, what'd you say? I just have all of what? What? When, you, when I said you looked it up, I said, how did you do that? You said, I just have what? Have all the Jackie Chan deaths memorized. Yeah, all I had it froze, and he said, "I just have all," and I just said, "Autism." Because <laughs> how you pulled that shit up so fucking fast is insane. Oh my god! You recognize him now because of his little hair lip, right? <laughs> no, I've never seen that shit. Joaquin Phoenix. I haven't seen Look the Joaquin Phoenix joke. Gladiator. Yet. Yeah, I just don't know the guy. Yeah, you do. I mean, I know who he is. I've seen his Joker clips, but in makeup. Forever and ever. You're pretty good at that voice. What is death? I want to have Jinx and, say real kind, all I'm kinds of dirty shit. I Kate Capshaw, you're so fine. I want to put myself inside your beautiful body. <laughs> Press your giant titties up against me, Kate Capshaw. You and me and Kelly Preston all together at once. I cannot wait. Leah Thompson yeah, can watch and pleasure he's herself. Like, he's like a pervy little robot. That'd be funny. He's yeah. like super pervy. What the fuck is this? They're like simulating zero gravity. It's all the simulations. Know, that looks like it'd be really fun. Yeah, it's space camp. It's not like remember, like you'd watch fucking Double Dare and shit. They'd get that'd be one of the prizes. You're going to space camp. We're gonna go fucking. To space camp. We're gonna put you in zero gravity, and we're gonna put you in Can wires. I go to space camp? You're a little too Can old I now. Space? I want to go. The computer rules. Damn, you better not be fucking around. You might have to hold your breath for extended periods of time while you're dealing with a high yeah. G-force. Flood uh, the room. <laughs> flood the room I and put them through, like, G-forces. Like, yeah, kids. like, they, yeah, they put them in that G-force thing. That's what you're saying. Where you have to, like, breathe right. Oh, here's the, the human uh, human spiroscope or whatever. Human gyroscope. Secure. Is that the actor from the nerds thing? Let's just say it is and stop talking about it. <laughs> Fine. I don't know. I think it is. Oh, this shit would probably get me a little. This machine is not as loud as this movie is making it seem. It is. I. 
it, it, what, don't turn it right or left. You're supposed to look at what's directly in front of you. You're supposed to control it. You're supposed to pilot it back to normal. Yeah, but like to not get dizzy, you're supposed to look at what's directly in front of you and not anything else. Right, right. She's gonna be sick just watching her. She starts puking in all directions. Well, that's like just spinning. that's just because she's bulimic, you know. That has nothing to do. She's with like this. spinning and puking everywhere. That'd be hilarious. <laughs> I'm sure that wouldn't have been the first. That, hell, that'd probably be the hundredth time that's happened. Someone puking on that thing. There's been more times than that. I'm I think sure. that's usually why in movies they put that in like a separate little enclosed little tank, you know, so that way in case they do puke, it gets all over the walls and shit. Not you're on like them. Projectile while you're spinning everywhere. <laughs> like a garden hose, fucking. <laughs> Kevin. No, no, you gotta say it like this. Kevin! <laughs> hey, I have the flight suits like those, except mine are orange. Flight suit? Yeah, that guy in the red flight suit. Oh, yeah. Does that mean because these guys are all the purple team, they're gonna get purple flight suits? That'd be badass. Well, why do you want to please anybody but yourself? <laughs> Hello, freezing. Uh, I don't. Uh, I'm not an expert, but uh, it seems to me that you just, if you just eased up on the thing, you, you, you could handle it. You know, you're just, you're just trying too hard. Don't you tell me what to do? You're mansplaining. We both have dimples. God, stop biting your lip like that at men. We're going to get the wrong idea, Leah. Um, Why are you leering at her like that? Because she's biting her lip at him. <laughs> That's why. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You're like, yeah, here, let me help you with that seatbelt. Let me help you get your crotch all fixed, uh, fixed situated. Put this harness over here like uh, like that. Oh, yeah. Tighter. Yeah, got you. Cop breaking curve. Stop looking at him like that. These guys are having inappropriate eye contact. Yeah, yeah that's gross me out, actually. I think it's cute. Except it's a children's movie, and it's not <laughs> It's not the time or place for this shit. That's Hello, a there's, a, there's a metaphor for her. <laughs> You've been coming here for a couple of years, right? Um, what's the best way to get to the beach? You gonna ask him? Shh. Fish track and destroy the Imperial Guard. Um, Got ten seconds. All right, uh, what would, uh, what would, uh, Luke Skywalker do? How would he get launched? It's gonna go from the droid. Yo, Jinx. Yo, Mom. Jinx, what's the best way to launch pad? Go out to Main Gate, go to Highway, turn left. <laughs> that, um, that takes me right by Zach Bergsman's <laughs> office. There's gotta be some... Is there another way to launch pad, Jinx? A secret way? Secret. Turn left before Zach's office. Turn right at Rocket Park. Avoid maintenance building. Go east. Depending on ground speed, beach can be reached between 5 minutes Go on, and 7 talk. seconds and 15 minutes, 12 seconds. Ooh, romantic music. They're going on a date. American girl. Digging the soundtrack so far. Some like not bullshit songs. <laughs> like most of the time. <laughs> God. Dude, we watched Space Invaders and that movie ends with the most annoying fucking song. And I think it even has a voice like that, like that Jinx robot. Martians. Oh, <laughs> God. Can you believe that I can go uh-huh. from Earth up into the stars? Yeah. I can't wait to leave all these fucking humans behind. She got little red planes as earrings. <laughs> so, uh, you really into the space stuff, huh? Are they in Houston or Florida? Ever since I was a little girl. Yeah. Yeah. My dad used I'm gonna to guess Florida, because... 
I mean, Houston's by a much shittier beach, but yeah, I mean, well, I NASA, thinking. NASA. I mean, yeah. it's one or the other. The third coast, they call it. Is it? They're not even near the ocean. You're just hearing Leah Thompson's panties right now. <laughs> I can't wait to get grown up and have sex, be an adult, and get laid. <laughs> Going down. Hey, yo. In space, anything is possible. That's not true. Breathing <laughs> is impossible in space. There's a lot of things that aren't possible in space that are possible here on Earth. Yeah. yeah. Not having your your insides boil. <laughs> that's 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 not possible here on Earth, but it is up there on space. For people who are afraid to you know, space sucks. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, it does. It's definitely, we don't belong in the, in the environment. Not well, proper. Just the ocean. The ocean itself freaking scares me. Space is pretty fucked up. I'm going to sit up on the hood next to you. Uh, what do you, you want to try? Is she gonna no. put the moves on him? No, she's trying to touch us way there. I'll never tell. Torture me, kill me, I'll still never tell. Fess up, where's Kevin? I thought his name was Hideo. Catherine's gone too. All right. They immediately Where forgot about that. Kevin and Catherine. They're probably having sex in a closet somewhere. Oh, Jinx, you're so silly. Why is the thing? Why is the thing in the locker, and we're leaving it there? Like, shouldn't they say, "Hey, that doesn't belong there"? It's a million-dollar droid you've confiscated. Right. Oh, look at that! No time wasted. <laughs> But we were gonna watch the launch. As oh a man, metaphor. it was so close to fucking. Oh, dude, you're ruining it. Yeah, well, I kind of cleared it. Yeah, kind of. Ah, shit. I'm out of here. He's she's mad at him now because she she got caught busting curfew. She didn't realize they weren't supposed to be out there. He still has a boner. <laughs> He's like, God damn it. My pants hurt. My pants hurt. Kath, we were just talking. That's not the Give me the gossip, girl. Spill the tea. Nobody cares about <laughs> space camp more than I do. Do you like him? Really? Let me know, LOL. I need to know, girl. <laughs> the first time I met you, I saw it in your eyes. It's like looking in a mirror. Derp a derp. Oh, not that kind of special. I see. Why are you so hard on me? Why are you calling me stupid? <laughs> She's like, you're so special. Why are you such a bitch? <laughs> Why are you being so mean? There's no room for ladies. Never fuck up. <laughs> No mistakes allowed, ever. Ever. <laughs> you make one mistake, we all die. Copy. Copy. I copy. ASMR voice right there. I copy. I copy. I copy. Copy that, Ranger. There's got to be like a must sleep with clothes on rule at the bunk, you know? Just like sleep fully nude. That's <laughs> how I sleep, bro. Deal with it. It wasn't me, Han Solo. You can't sleep unless I'm butt naked. Fucking, that's my okay. deal. Okay, so all these references to Star Wars, did that cost at money? I don't also, know, John Williams, like, wrote the... Yeah, John Williams did the score. Kate Camshaw, Steven Spielberg's uh, wife. And there's 
no force, and there's no dark side, okay? You're just an ordinary kid, and so am I. Oh, just wait till you tell this little uh, Joaquin Phoenix what happened with the Star Wars sequels once Disney bought it. Oh, he won't be happy. Don't be a little bitch. What? You, what? What? Like in a what galaxy is... far away? No, stupid kid. Weren't you listening? I'm gonna go run off in traffic. <laughs> you were mean. It's gonna kill that guy for yelling at his friend. <laughs> <laughs> They're going to wake up and that kid's insides are going to be out of his body. He's all covered in blood. Pulled out of his throat. <laughs> be careful what you wish for. Did Joaquin Phoenix ever go into space in any other movies? Did he ever play an astronaut? Mm hmm. The little droid blinds gonna like make sure this kid goes to space. No, I guess this is the only one. Space camp. Where we have little droid bots. You think do... someone should turn this thing off by now or No, who plugs it in? Like where's it is it nuclear powered? Like <laughs> Who's charging this son of a bitch? All right, the John Williams score is not necessary for this movie. Seriously. <laughs> it's having a core meltdown. Everyone needs to evacuate the building. About to explode. Oh, the oh my god, is he he's going to grant the kids wish basically? Is this how they end up Is this how they end up in space? They've already established the robot takes everything literally and doesn't understand the nuance. <laughs> That's what happens. There is no max listed in astronaut program. Let me just help you. <laughs> okay. Right. So what are you doing after this? Nothing. You want to get a beer or something? Sure. <laughs> First rounds on you. Ha ha ha. I love how their teacher just runs around in these little spaghetti strap tank tops the whole fucking summer. Well, it's base camp t shirt. Yeah, I want that space camp polo. Atlantis, this is control. We have to go, honey. Nautical miles, inclination of 35 degrees. You are in position for satellite recovery. Do you have to sound so bitchy about it, station? <laughs> like, God. <laughs> how, is, how is this shuttle going to be launched in space? This makes no sense. Um, it can't be. Well, we're dead. Somebody get me down from here, I'm gonna be sick! This gets perfect for space. Rude, relax, man, you're freaking out. Rude, bro. This is Atlantic. Hey, rude boy! Experiencing electrical failure, switching to auxiliary cells. That's my decision, not yours, okay? Oh, it's right here. It's the green one right next to the red. Oh, no, it's just auxiliary. I knew that was happening. Rudy, what are you doing? I think that was the wrong one. I got it right now. Here you go. Here you go. Just the one over here, right? Here. This is the one. Rudy, just cross wire. Hey, sit down. Just sit down. That's an order. Now there are electricians. She's just got to get in everyone's business. She's got to do everyone's job. This is high school kids. What the hell is yeah, I think so. Yeah. 
if they're like are like dealing with electricity failures. Yeah. Like nice. electricians. Space camp. Teaching children that it's okay to just tinker with electronics like that. When you're in space and you're experiencing a catastrophic power failure, yes. Yeah, but are they dealing with actual electronics? Because they're, 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 they're yeah, kind they're of a fine. safety hazard. They're fine. I think it's a lawsuit waiting. I'm sure they make these kids sign all kinds of waivers. It's true. That's the thing. You think you want a, a summer to, to fucking space camp, and the truth is you're going to be tortured and put in, you know, chambers. And... You're coming up on Interface Atlantis. Roger that, Atlantis. She's going to get in there, too, and is the hot teacher's going to be up in space with them also? I hope so. I want to see those things in zero gravity. <laughs> Fight, 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 fight. Steve, Steve, Steve. I'm sorry, but Rudy was... Yeah, Rudy, quiet. Shut up. Look at these. I don't want to hear about it. My eyes are up here, kids. Because you're all dead. Yeah, I'm stupid. You just disintegrated during re-entry. Oh, I'm going to get re-entry into her. You're all dead because you didn't work together as a team. And now everyone's dead. It's all your fault. So stupid. You're responsible. <laughs> Me? That's right, you. Your shuttle commander. That means you are responsible for everything that happens on this ship. I didn't ask to be responsible, remember? Boy, I oughta. Pitiful excuse for killing me. Lab room. Space camp. This kid's like, uh, I'm probably just here at space camp. And, um, nobody had killed, okay? Not yet. Everyone's okay. You're like, we're at space camp. Yeah, how is this fucking. <laughs> also, nobody's walked into this room since last night to see this robot tinkering on all the computers. Oh my god. Who did the voice of this robot? I want to strangle him. Well, hi, you two. How are you doing? What's up first? That's FRF. Flight readiness firing. That's how NASA tests the main engines of the shuttle. This is the first year we got permission for you guys to experience it. And some of you are even going to be able to sit in this. Oh, that's how they get in space. Purple team. We're going to put the purple team in a shuttle and test the rockets, but I promise we're not going to launch it into space. If only you had just destroyed that stupid droid. The best is the robot thinks he's doing good. That's how that's how fucking bad they fucked up making this thing. Max on shuttle engine test. How do we change engine test into lift off? thermal curtain failure. Yo, it might die. Dude! That is how the fucking Challenger exploded. They had a rocket fail. They had a booster fail. Is that the same year? The same year. Holy shit. Crazy. That's insane. It's like predictive programming again. I really pray the Starship tomorrow goes well. I would hate to see something the size of a skyscraper explode. Are there people on board? I'm, I actually haven't looked into that. If Never there know. isn't, then fuck, it'd be awesome to watch something that big explode. What are you talking about? I mean, yeah, but I want it to work. I can't wait till we start making spaceships that are so big they can't even launch from Earth. We have to build them in space. you sick. We have robots build them for us in space. So they got a little Navy blue. Is that supposed to be purple? Yeah. 
No, that's blue. That, that doesn't look very purple. It's like a lavender, if anything. It's definitely baby blue. God! Dude, they're driving up to a real space rocket. That's cool. That is the Challenger! Dude, what the fuck? Oh, no! Oh, oh my no, God! Is it? it is! It Holy really shit. is! Oh, they, they've, they've changed the name to Atlantis just for this movie. That's supposed to say Sh uh, Challenger for sure. Holy crap, dude. They didn't even realize that the people that are going to get into this thing a few a month or two later are going to die. With all their families watching, too? Holy shit. Dude. Also, why did this team get to go in first since they were sucking? You'll be lucky if you last 20 seconds, kid. Glad they let him in there. I am glad this stupid robot isn't going up in space with them, because I've had enough of him. <laughs> He's a bit much. Well, they're letting these children into the real rocket. Because it was, it would, it's a fun idea, and then it fucks up on the very first try because some robot asked another robot. I don't know why I've never heard of this or seen this. I honestly hadn't heard of it either. I was just looking up movies, uh, you know, that were allowed on YouTube. I just looked up full movies, 1985, and this one came up. Oh, Kelly. Let's push all the buttons. I'm on the laser guns? I can't wait to kill some commies for you. I forgot him. Oh, I gotta take a shit. I gotta take a shit. Oh. They're not in spacesuits or anything, so what the fuck do they do when the thing launches? I'm about to get fired. Oh my god, it's Terry O'Quinn! Oh shit! What the hell's he doing in this movie? Everybody's in this movie! Go ahead. Thanks. She's not mad at him anymore. This is Atlantis. Uh, radio check satisfactory. Over. High school kids are fully capable of being trained to deal with the rocket. You were on the radio. Like, oh my God, you're famous. Like not real space helmets. <laughs> I'm saying they're not even in real like spacesuits. So what are they gonna do? That's like a motorcycle helmet or something. So, this is such a terrible idea. Like we're just gonna test the engine just to see, so you get kids feel it vibrate. Seems like a big waste of fuel too. It just explodes. Good job for testing the engines, children. Like, what the f There's so many things that can go wrong with this type of shit, you know? I'm in love with you and the rocket, but mostly the rocket. <laughs> the rocket just explodes and kills them all. Booster B. Well, that's not no. expected. Oh, you idiot. This is the worst possible situation. Andy. Booster B, temperature is critical. 
Take your seatbelts off. That's a, that's definitely not good. It's gonna light. Launch us or we're gonna explode. Oh my god, this suddenly got all fucked up at the 54 minute mark. Yeah, that wouldn't be too nice. The G-Force on that would probably make most of those people uh, pass out. Is it like 9 Gs or something? 8 Gs? Vaya con Dios. Uh, isn't it around 8 Gs? Yeah, something like that. It's not good. Not fa I definitely want to be in your seat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But also, too, like, do you want to breathe? Because you're gonna pass out and wake up in We're space. We're gonna get in big trouble. Oh, you guys! Oh. What are those stupid kids doing in the control room this whole time? No. It sounded like it said die. Die, Max. Oh, off to face now. I'm so sick and tired of your fucking Star Wars quotes. Burn in hell. Instituting roll maneuver, Atlantis. Roger, control. They just like lay there, like we're rolling. I mean, it would press you against the wall. Try spinning. That helps. You want to take it? Uh, we're all fired. You know that, right? Yeah. <laughs> It feels awesome. Uh, guess you're not gonna have to wait so long after all. I got you up in space, babe. I did it all for you. Happy you Valentine's Day. Throttle. The throttle's feeling really good. Oh. It's, it's, it's control. <laughs> throttle. Ooh, throttle, throttle harder. Oh. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> Jeez. Drop the solid boosters. They're on your side. Now arm SRB separation. I don't know which one. Fuck it, idiot. Listen to me. Do I have to do everything? On your right side. Atlantis, you are go for SRB separation. She could have pushed that button. Oh, shit. <laughs> Atlantis, this is control. Press for Miko. You are go for main engine cutoff. Roger. As long as that lady had be scared shitless, then these kids are gonna have it together. She just saw how they performed a minute ago. Like, I'm dead. Here comes the fucking parents. Oh boy. I don't know where this drill's gonna end, baby. But I'm going to jail. But when you get home, we're definitely doing it. Control, this is Atlantis. Do you read? Over. Atlantis. We're losing her. This bird wasn't flight ready, Zach. They only have short range radio. Oh, dude. Dana, oh my. There's no way. We have Miko. Why did you take your helmet off? He drops it and it hits that chick in the back of the head, but it hit people in the face. Damn, dude, we just like. What's up with us and the space littering? <laughs> like, just like leaving these giant rockets out in. Like, in the where ocean. Does that, where does that thing fall? In the ocean, in the ocean. 
There's lots of it in the ocean. Awesome. Tracking reads Atlantis at 180 by 33. They're in orbit. But we cannot communicate with them because they have short range radios. Uh, so they only have like 30 minutes of oxygen. <laughs> I mean, it's really. I know. <laughs> We're gonna die. Jeez. Catherine, are you okay? I think so. <sighs> You're floating. Just relax and allow yourself to flow with me. Oh, I could lose the lift off, but this is incredible. Wow. Wait, this is, this is unreal. Look at these cool little wire work they're doing. <laughs> the first black man in space. The first black gay dude in space. Ever. Don't even bring up that other movie. Yeah, there you go. This is the only person acting normal. Like, <laughs> what the fuck are we doing here? Feels like a dream. I, yeah, I'd be like thinking maybe I'm dead already. Green screen. We're totally fucked. <laughs> My stupid dangly earrings scared me. No one ever tells us how to pee or poo here. Yeah. Are you all in one piece? The party's gonna end it really quickly soon. Like once we get used to floating, it's like all right, now we gotta. How do we get back down? Fun's over. This John Williams score is so unnecessary. John Williams could have made didn't done help do a better movie in the eighties. Don't talk dirty to me. I'm still, the incinerated I'm st instantly. I'm still mad at you, Hideo. Wow. Forever. No, you can't. We have literally, See, like... By the way, we didn't bring any supplies. FYI. Yeah, we have no food or water. We're going to have to eat Dave, or whatever his name is. Yeah, Dave. Or Ken? Who was it? The end. <laughs> they just fly off into space, like a bad trajectory. Yeah, we do want to go home, don't we? This is our home. It's not important how it happened. Are you sure you don't want to take off that uh, that that jacket there, Kate, Andy? Both of them need all your help to get there. Where do you and Kevin stow the abduct seats? We have no voice contact with NASA. Telemetry is still on. See, the safest procedure will be for them to bring us down on auto at the next available window. Windows out there? No, it's where we re enter the Earth's atmosphere at the right time and place so we can land at Edwards Air Force Base. First re entry for Edwards is in 12 hours. We're a mountain on accident. Damn. Okay. We just sit tight. We got 12 hours to hang out in space. In the meantime, I'm going to check this mother out. Absolutely what? I don't know what to tell you, Ray. Standing right there. Well, look, all I know is I want that gallery cleared out. If you do me a favor and take those kids back to space camp. Christ, the president has to be told. We'll be back in 12 hours. <laughs> the hell it's not a big deal, dude. People we accidentally launch people into space all the time. Tell them the truth. We launched <laughs> my wife and five kids from the space camp. They'll never believe it. You know, the expensive of a, of a mistake that that is. <laughs> yeah, that's like, that requires like one, lots of like, many mistakes to millions, happen in millions concession. And millions yeah. And millions of dollars, yeah. yeah. And also millions and millions that's, and millions. Yeah, that's not like one little mistake or one big mistake. That's like fucking six minimum giant mistakes in, se in sequence, you know? <laughs> well, first we got the kids in the shuttle, uh-huh. And then we uh, yeah, thought about turning the rockets on, uh-huh. 
And then uh, the <laughs> rockets uh, were, you know, the computers. We left our little droid on and running around the the building, <laughs> communicating the with the computers. And then uh, we just said, "Fuck it," you know. You know, we're gonna have to fire up the other one. You know, That's, figure it's better than blowing them up. No, so we'll figure it out later. You know. Oh no! Oh no! All right, stop breathing, y'all. One hundred percent. Get Matt out of space now. How? NASA needs More. I wish the whole movie was just these two robots talking to each other because I can't get enough of it. It's pure cinema. Yeah, it's pure cinema. It's peak, like the kids say nowadays. It's peak, bro. <laughs> Pilot, She's got a great ass too. I'm very you. jealous of you. Great. No oxygen was provided for the life support system. There. What about the propulsion system? We can raid the liquid oxygen from there. The propulsion system uses nitrogen tetroxide, Rudy. It's poisonous. Not nitrogen tetroxide. Yeah, but I mean, fuck, dude. I want to feel like I'm walking all sunshine. You know what I mean? Right, Kev. That's it. Now you're calling him Kev, huh? You want to, like, share this with us? Yep. We're going to Daedalus. The space station. That's right. But isn't it still under construction? Uh-huh. But they already have oxygen storage. Kevin nice. Gaines, the and we're going to use their oxygen. Never. We're going to transfer to another orbit. We did no clearance for this, and we're doing it anyways. Yeah, I also hope we don't suffocate in this fucking rocket. Guys, we might all die, but we're all having a great time, right? Space camp! Yeah, we all died, but at least I got to kiss a girl. Hell yeah. Kevin, you did this in the simulator. Come on. Faked it in the simulator. Yeah, come on, Kevin. Think it out of seat. Douche. Fucking, you're fired. <laughs> you're on toilet duty now. You're the janitor for the ship. Catherine, give me a course bearing. O nine or five five nine. Stand by for Ohmsburg. Two niners. Oh boy. Go for Ohms. Oh. Um. Like when you just like smug. I mean, I get it. I get it. You're stressed out. Uh-huh. Gotta be pretty intense. Oh, hell yeah. Kevin? I've got to say this rendezvous would be a whole lot easier for you. Did you do it? It was too difficult. Tell me what you did. poop right in the bang bang. Can you he got all over the toilet and bathroom. <laughs> I don't know how to poop at zero G. All right, now, Max. Very simple, okay? Okay. Just like a dentist chair. You, you just stick this hose inside of you. <laughs> it sucks everything out. Yeah, if your penis gets ripped off, it's okay because you're a virgin. <laughs> what the fuck? So now try it. Don't get Wait, what? Out, okay? Yeah, you got to get naked to take a shit. So it sucks about onesies and jumpers and all that stuff. Let the shit vacuum suck the shit right out of your why ass. Is this, why is the earth see through there? That was weird. Made it. Um, how much you want to bet something else is going to go wrong? <laughs> yeah, they collide directly into the thing. A bunch of Chinese dudes on that space station, like, what the fuck? Yeah, dude, the Russians, uh, the guys on there, are like, they trigger a nuclear war between the <laughs> fucking <laughs> Russia and the United States. <laughs> space pirates have invaded our Russian station. <laughs> well, I've been giving that a lot of thought lately, and I've come up with one good idea. I had an idea. 
she's gonna come up with the right answer because she's actually secretly the smartest one on the ship. <laughs> I read her instruments. Maybe I was just like inspired by the view and all, but like the three of these ladies together, this is such like hot babe star power. I can't even handle it. Oh, oh yeah. Well, code. The CXT switch. You mean Morse code? Yeah, I read a book on it once. <laughs> Terrific. <laughs> Go get on the switches. Good idea, Tish. They gotta hear us. Tish. All right, Catherine, I need you to help me get ready. The Tishandra was her real name. Yeah, we know you're in an SOS situation. Yeah, SOS, that's all they're saying. Duh. Yeah, like, we know. Duh. Like, we already know that part. Now say something. Oh, they're not going to notice for fucking several hours. Right. It's so over the top for this it's, movie. It's also like I'm hearing very distinct parts from other movies I've heard. Yeah. Someone just walks up to it, turns them off. What's this thing doing? NASA doesn't have like a tracking device on this thing that they built that costs a lot of money. Oh, here's your spacesuits. Oh, so they're just gonna bring uh, oxygen onto their ship. <laughs> okay, that seems smart, I guess. I hope you don't die, or we're fucked. Oh, look at his, like, penis envy. He's so upset. <laughs> Little... I mean, you've just been saying the whole time how you're faking it, and you don't care, and all this shit, and then you get upset when you're demoted. Like, which is it? That's a douche. Stupid Hideo. God. Classic Japanese. He's gonna start hyperventilating and wasting air. <laughs> that was when uh, I was on the swim team. Special year. Rudy, could you like shut up? We used please. To do it too. Just right for hours. Just by thinking about eating French fries. And sucking dick. Shut your mouth. Stop flapping them big old lips, boy. <laughs> Sorry. My God, dude. He had big lips. Bro. Holy shit. You're so canceled right now. <laughs> you better edit that out. That's fucked up. You think they put some furniture in here or something? I don't know. <laughs> it's looking a little bare. You could really use an interior decorator. That's all I'm saying. Catherine, do you copy? Roger, Andy. Prepare to open CBD. CBD? Cargo bay doors, Rudy. Yeah, CBD, dude. We're about to get lit. I'm trying to get these kids high to calm them down. on fake weed. Mm hmm? Hemp weed. Holy shit. She forgot her adult diaper. Yeah, she's like blind from looking directly in the sun with no ozone layer. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> you gotta have that mirror glass down, you know. <laughs> or that will fuck you up. 
Instant skin cancer. Instant fucking sunburn. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> she's like, <laughs> she's gonna come back on the main ship looking like Richard Dreyfus. The close encounters. Fucking face all pink. No, like Clint Eastwood and, and fucking. I think it's in the, uh, the desert. Yeah. They just watch her, like, descend into the atmosphere and light on fire. <laughs> like, what the hell? Guys. Uh oh. We only have one hour left. So and so couldn't shut the fuck up. Wait, they've been on the ship for 12 hours already? It's 11 hours? Why is she not tethered on any level? She's got her little suit. Rockets. <laughs> Seems like a bad idea. Seems Just risky at best. At <laughs> best. She's never done it before. She just collides with right. shit. Yeah, be confident. Be confident. Don't put your pants. Don't put your pants. If you shit in your flight suit, in your spacesuit, do you lose weight or gain weight? Like, what happens there? It's the same. The weight distribution is different. Oh, Joaquin what? got lucky there. Oh, wait, I forgot to bring a screwdriver. <laughs> They're stuck on well, here. <laughs> Stupid. What is she trying to do? She's going to steal these oxygen tanks from this base and put them on board her ship. Come on, please. We can't reach them, my little arms. Oh, you gotta take the rocket pack off. No power, no control. She'll tumble out into space without her jet pack. Where is she? That's retarded. Uh, you shouldn't do that. No. Oh my uh, god, dude. I'm like on the edge of my seat right now. Honestly, this is fucked up. I'm sorry. I didn't this use, is like didn't gravity. Use word. I'm just saying at that time frame, that's what they would have said. At that time frame, it's in the '80s. I was just trying to, you know. Yeah. Fit in with the era. Liquid. I'm gonna take my space helmet off so I can <laughs> fit. <it. laughs> oh man! <laughs> with the level of stupid of the other thing, I wouldn't even be surprised. If I just take my helmet off real quick, close my eyes, and hold my breath, I'll be able to get it. Jesus. It's no good. I just can't reach it. We're all gonna die. She has to. Tell her she has to get him. All right, stay calm. Stop breathing, y'all. Stop breathing. Everyone shut up and stop breathing. Joaquin. Yeah. Put him in a little suit. Actually, if he dies, he's like the least one we'd worry about. He's just a stupid kid, Push right? Double check everything, you guys. In? He's in this baggy suit that don't even fit. Is this the only suit you could find? It's the best I could do. It's the only one down there. Oh, dish, dish, Stop breathing so hard. Oh, excellent idea. Oh, huh? What are you going to do with the belt? We are going to make this suit as small as Max so he can fit through the Oh, my junk! Ow! Oh! Ooh. Hurls off this space. little fucker comes out to save you, and you're like, oh boy, how the hell, you know? Oh my god, this is not cool. Little Joaquin is... Phoenix has to do a spacewalk. Commander Skywalker reporting in. No, dude. Groan. Make sure that arm is arm is unlocked and double check everything. Okay. Catherine? Mm -hmm. Radio check is okay. Oh, okay. What about these doors? It's good screwed. No, no, no. It's okay. They have to be able to get back in on it. Okay, Max. Get strapped into the RMS, and Rudy will swing you over to Dalen. Roger. Here we go. Wee! Ah! No 
Stop screaming, you're wasting your air. Max, you have to help Andy. Help me in, please let me in. Luke. Luke. I hate this fucking movie. Force. Stretch out your feelings. Force. God, kids oh, are stupid. <laughs> It just makes me want to watch Star Wars. Like, it's death. <coughs> you could have let him inside, but this guy talked him into doing something real stupid. Then again, they kind of are all going to die otherwise, so. Yeah, I mean, Go it's, for either, it, it's, Luke. Either, it's either die here in the suit or die in the ship. Although dying in the ship would be better, because at least you're with, like, you know, a couple hot Bettys. Uh, guess. I don't know. Maybe radio her and tell her you're coming. No, we sent the kid. He's gonna uh, touch her and scare the shit out of her. Yeah. It's me. I'm here to rescue you. I'm hetero to rescue. <laughs> so the time to too short. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you take off your oxygen pack, kid. Sacrifice oh, yourself. It. He's right in there. Boop, 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 boop. Fuck, fuck. Oxygen critical. Okay, Max. I'm going to take this back to the ship. You're on your own. But if we leave without you, don't take it personal. Bye. Rudy, Rudy, please keep that arm steady, please. Hi, friend, he's doing the best that he can. I know, but she is trying to load the canisters. Could you guys Everyone argue without Calm talking? down. It's okay. We still have a little bit of time. All we have left is here in the cabin. They're on their way. It's okay. Just everyone be cool. Oh fuck, they're they're dead. <laughs> what if I just use all the oxygen for myself? <laughs> he just puts the nozzle right up to his mouth. Oh, you idiot. Dude, no! Hang on to something. Oh, my oh shit! God. She, he's dead. Oh, no. I am so fired. <laughs> Your sentence here he goes. Oh, and now she's going to die, too. They're going to lose both oxygen tanks. They're dead. Max. I'm right behind you. All you have to do is tug the rope. That's what I was thinking. You I just know. tug the I rope, know. and the tank starts coming your way, and you start riding the, the tank the, your, the other way. Moron. They're, like, wasting their... Die. Just chill, kid. All right, just breathe. Get it's like the the general theme in this story is like maintain your cool. Do not freak out. Got his foot. The belt's gonna untie. Holy shit, now go back. You're about to... The moon's nowhere close to that close. 
Yeah, if they were that close, they'd be pulled. They'd be getting pulled in. Why do your parents get the bill for breaking daylight? No, seriously, we're gonna sue you, kid. We're gonna, we're gonna. Die. You're the reason why we got launched in space. You fucking with becoming friends with that robot. This is why robots are not our friends. Forty minutes to be entry. Even, even when they try to be friends, they accidentally kill you. Let's hope there's oxygen on the end of it. Let's hope we don't listen to my wife and those students suffocate slowly on the intercom. Okay. Hey, folks. Stupenzo here, coming from the future in post-production while editing this. I kind of realized that from here on out, this movie gets so fucking intense that me and my cousin kind of stopped talking. So, we were on the edge of our seats. This movie gets insane. So, I'm filling in for my past self right now. Let's see if I'm pick up this weight. Uh <laughs> Who'd have thought being launched in space on accident wouldn't be fun? Next to the to the green. Rudy, which blue graph out next to the green? There is no green. No, 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 not green. I I I meant yellow. She's just got to do everything. She's got to girl boss everything. Andy? Uh, it's the blue valve next to the red. Wrong. No, it's the yellow. It's, not, it's the red one. Oh, Somebody God. please make a decision. Trust the black dude. Andy. It's the red one, Andy. No. I'm telling you, it's the yellow. Now, I've been studying this damn book since I came to camp. God, he's sweating. Right. Believe me. Don't trust Little Miss Know It All. Uh uh. Don't believe anything. Andy. It's the blue valve next to the yellow valve. Okay. If you say so. The music. You better be right, Rudy, or we're all dead. He's right. No way someone who sweats that much could be wrong. Oh. Hell yeah! Yeah! <laughs> she brought the tank. Let's get lit. Woo! Oh boy. You muted? Yeah, I was just saying, like, you know, I didn't mean to. I, I was like, now go out and get another tank. You know, I was like, yeah. I need to go grab another one now. Like, all right, good job on the first one. Now, can y'all do that one more time? That giant tank's only good for like 30 minutes. Bring him out home. Oh. He's like flying off again. No, you're like, God damn it. <laughs> again. Thanks. Dude, wouldn't it be fucked up if this lady died or something like that? Like, holy shit. Ah. I honestly don't know. I feel like none of these kids are safe. Yep, see? My back is broken. Andy. Here's the one with the jetpack. Now we're both gonna fly off into space again. What's <laughs> what is up with the slow motion in space? In space, people can hear you scream slower than normal. Everything's responding. No. Who's closing the cargo bay doors? Help me. Jesus. Not in yet. Come on, Andy. Please. A little harder, weirdo. This Let's give her a tic-toe. She weighs nothing. <laughs> Literally weightless. 
This John Williams score is doing its magic now. Good God, this movie's like intense. Uh, just another movie. another another movie that just shows that space sucks. What the fuck, man? No, I'm sleeping. Dude. Dude. <laughs> dude, 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 dude. 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 This is legitimately fucked up. I thought, I thought we were watching a fun kids movie. And we'll get grounded. Yeah, we can re-enter whenever, guys. It's not about, you know, we'll just land somewhere else. You only have X amount of oxygen. And Andy's about to burn up into the atmosphere. They're entering upside down and backwards. I mean, that can't be good. Take the window? Is she seriously trying to kill herself? Nine seconds. Five. Do something, Catherine. No. Two seconds. The one time you get responsibility and you choke. You've killed us all, you idiot! It was your idea! She's gonna turn it off! It's those damn trumpets. Ma'am, ma'am! We're gonna strap the fuck in because you're all about to experience Earth gravity. It's just about to suck. I mean, yeah, can't you just turn the manual override off and then bring her back in and then turn it back on? I mean, is it a huge deal? Pull faster, you know? A little Joaquin Phoenix is such a little actor. A little thespian. Somebody looked at that hair lip and was like, You're going places, son. Grab her by the tuchus. You saved her. Oh, we're about to burn her death. This kid got kissed by Kelly Preston and got to embrace Kate Capshaw. Lucky little punk. All in one movie. She get knocked out by that also. Maybe be careful with her. All of her fucking organs are smushed. Andy. I'll get her gloves. Let's get her out of She just starts vomiting blood all over the fucking space station. <laughs> oh, she's like real hurt. nothing. Yeah, the fact that she's been doing Morse code this whole movie and they never noticed. Assholes. And missed the window. How much oxygen did they buy? Not enough to make it to the next window at Edwards. Why? Wow. Missed the last chance. Something was obviously going on. We're just having such a fun time, we don't want to come down just yet. That's what's going on. Are they putting her in a body bag? How is she? Oh, I was like, what the hell? Uh, I think she shattered her arm and, uh, she well, don't touch it. Way. Ow! It's her other arm that's broken, I see. You gotta send a little fucker out there again for more oxygen. But we have got to do something. Christ, I'm not a doctor. I don't know what to do. He's doing a Chris Walken impression right there. Guys. Not a doctor. I'm not a doctor. I don't, I don't know, know what, what to do. do. Wow. I don't know what to do. <laughs> I'll, stay, I'll stay alone with the hot, unconscious teacher. Oh, no, you won't. Don't look over here. Does that kid have to be using the bathroom right in front of us like that? Jesus. <laughs> little space toilet suit. Keep touching her shattered arm. <laughs> K. 
can I get in on that? I want to get hugged by Kelly Preston. This is boring. Well, should we try date number two? I know. Yeah. Then now we're all gonna die, not just her. I think so. Look, we'll just go back to the station and get more oxygen. <laughs> that last time was easy. Somebody had to. Somebody had to be getting the blame. That's what makes a good flight command. Stop breathing. Life is like a box of chocolates. Being wing commander is like a box of chocolates. Shuttle commander. Same thing. I'm never gonna see her again, Emma. Come on. Come on. I hate seeing girls cry. Stop it. No, sir, there's nothing new here. Finally, someone, anybody? Is Tom Skerritt gonna be the guy that finally notices it? I think we're missing some new. Nope. <laughs> Still oblivious. I got an idea. Let's hear it. Let's lose our virginity. Hey, uh, Kai. Do it with a bang if you know what I'm saying. Yeah. I got a question. Will you take my virginity too, Hideo? I was can I? In the wondering, is Edwards the only place where we can land this thing? Of course not. I don't know, is it? I mean, it's That's why that was a stupid thing to think in the first place. Something about the shuttle landing in White Plains or something. White plans. Kelly Preston's gonna remember. White sands. White sands no yeah, let's hit ground. Let's land on the ground. Edwards was too wet. It was a big emergency. Uh, so if we could make the window to White Sands, we can land there. Tish, get going. Make them hear us. All right. Hey, I've been to White Sands. I tripped mushrooms at there a few times. We would all go out there and get fucking lit. Just sit around and ride sand dunes on little trash can lids and stuff. And what else? Mostly just sit around and be goofy. Shit looked crazy. Felt like Jim Morrison, man, following naked Indians. Except the naked Indians were, you know, hot chicks. Who let the stupid robot in here? How'd you know about Max, James? James and Max, friend forever. <laughs> I hate the stupid robot. Thank you. Get security and execute it. Go shoot it in the field somewhere. Beat it up with baseball bats like an office space. Jinx, how can you help NASA? Oh, look at the Jinx for saving the day. I'll be damned. I'm so tired of its voice. Why did we program it to have such an annoying voice? Say something! <laughs> Look at it! <laughs> I fucking hate this shit! Ooh! I don't none of the oil. None of the cheap stuff, hopefully. I am not run on gasoline or oil. Imagine how much better it would be if he had Pierce Brosnan's voice or something. They're going to do it. Who gives a shit? It's like a giant desert. never going to hear this. You could you could land a giant space shuttle there randomly. No one would even fucking notice. Some park rangers, maybe. They're responding. They're responding. Take away my talking. Take away my credit card. I take that back. Don't take away my credit card. They're talking. Let's look at what they're saying. What the fuck are we doing? They're paying attention to what they're telling us. NASA. NASA. Ah. Guys, guys, they need an Ohm's burn 
like now. Bones burn coming right up. Window coordinates? Tell Andy she's got to slow that thing down to 4800. And someone bring me some goddamn aspirin. Andy's hurt. Some kid named Catherine is flying the bird. Oh, Christ. 113 by 17? Window coordinates 113 by 17. Roger that. We figured two. He was measuring his dick just now. Well, we weren't that far off. A time parameter 0210. Uh, we have to be at reentry at 0210, and that's in. Uh... Stop doing that thrusting, whatever you're doing. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's get it, kids. Max. Andy. Oh, give me a headset. She wants a headset. She wants a headset? All right. She wants a headset? She wants a headset. We can handle it, okay? Max, you and Andy get strapped in. I want to listen to my favorite. Oh, my arm is shattered. I want to hear. Yeah, I want to hear Toto. I want to hear. Yeah, I want to hear Toto. I want to hear Cool and the Gang on re-entry. Look, look, look. What's the worst thing that can happen? We'll all die, right? No. We're all going to die if you don't do it, so... Just relax, okay? You're panicked. You're damn right I'm panicked. Okay. Fine. We're all going to die if you fuck up. It's no big deal. You got this. Tish? You ever read a book on how to fuck Dying this thing? sucks. Dying a virgin? <laughs> Pitiful. Okay. I'll do it. So competitive, aren't we? That was not the time, buddy. Okay, team. <laughs> yeah, she's on. still mad at you, dude. Let's do it. <laughs> hey, Catherine. Hey. Lock coordinates in. Coordinates locked in. The coordinates Stand are just three five. letters? Okay, whatever. <laughs> 29 seconds and counting. Hey, Max? 27. 26. No face shields of any kind. Evil. Right. Looks like a motorcycle helmet. Right. Starving for Three, pussy. Two, one, 18, mark. 17, 6. Oh, wait, I get it. All right. <laughs> John Williams music. It all sounds the same. It's beautiful. You're doing great, pilot. <laughs> you think okay. so? He Take likes me. Entry interface in two minutes. Terry O'Quinn. God, everyone's smoking in here. <laughs> Jesus. Yep. Complimentary NASA ashtrays. NASA brand Air cigarettes. Standing by. I wonder if they're allowed to vape in there. Uh, go for roll. You know they're stressed out. Gopher roll. <laughs> I love doing a good old fashioned gopher roll. Yeah. I like eating gopher rolls. It's like a barrel roll, but a gopher roll. Do a gopher roll! Nah, you get the gopher rolls at the sushi place. I can't. I can't fly. I just can't land this thing. I just didn't want to seem like weaker than you. Remember when I was in that thing and I couldn't stabilize? Like, kind of like that. <laughs> Remember when you fucked up earlier? Don't do that again. Holy shit! Why is it? It's coming in out of control. Ionization blackout in thirty seconds. Tracking's gonna lose him. Ain't that some shit? Oh well. Like, do these guys get paid extra at headquarters? You know. We're getting overtime right now because we haven't left the control room in two days. What to the or one day, whatever. The trainer. Remember the trainer. You can do it. Shouldn't there be like a visor or something on the helmet or anything? Andy? Yes. That's what I was trying to tell you. It's a motorcycle helmet. There's no visor on it or anything. This is it. It's your turn, bitch. Use the force. Don't fuck this up, girl. We will all die if you do. Just remember your boyfriend, Howard the Duck, waiting for you at home. Close Trace. your eyes and... Just close your eyes. Try spinning. That helps. Oh, she did it. That was easy. Problem solved. 
Also, I know I did this try spinning joke twice. Deal with it. I didn't realize we'd be putting this whole movie up, okay? okay. By the way, this is future Enzo, in case you didn't in know. All right, I think we do start talking uh, again. Like I said, the last 15 minutes of this, uh, the last 20 minutes of this movie were so intense, I forgot to talk. So anyway, I'm out of here. Hang out with past Enzo now. Increase the angle! Well, coffee? <laughs> Watch the readout on the nose attitude indicator. You can fly it, Catherine. Keep the nose at 30 degrees. 29. Come on, just a little bit more. Push it 30. No, you bitch. Up higher, pull harder. Pull harder, dude. Jesus. Stronger, faster. Do it. Make it. Pull it harder. Dirty. You're gonna burn degrees. up in the atmosphere. <laughs> like you're about to die. Boom! Tail dive. That's the end of the movie. The end. Dude, that'd be amazing. <laughs> it's just like dis disintegrates in space. They all like spontaneously combust. They did it! Now they're just free falling. Hooray! Oh wait, <laughs> shit! Gravity. Where are we? Yeah, we're not floating anymore. We're dead. We didn't make it. I wish. They were in the fucking. They were in a simulation the whole time. It's like surprise, we got gotcha! you. You kids were the first to experience the new, the breaking age space camp simulation. Traumatizing simulation. <laughs> <laughs> You've, You've been PTSD. in a holodeck the whole time, kids. What'd you think? Now we still have to land. Yet. Yeah, fuck, dude, Y'all stop celebrating, landed. idiots. We are so not out of the water yet. Like, it'd be the most embarrassing yeah. time to die now. Damn right we did. Yeah, but we haven't landed, though. We're still in a free fall, you know that, right? So is it, like, nighttime? Is that why it's all spooky outside? Mission Control! <laughs> Copy that, Control. This is Atlantis. Oh. Don't you want to know how we are? I mean, you guys are all celebrating. We could all be dead. I could be the sole survivor for all you know. We have to eat, uh, Dave. Yeah. We're all fine. Now you cheer. Now you start no, cheering. No, landed, though. Yeah, I know. Apparently landing this thing is super easy, I guess. Uh, are you gonna put down like landing gear? Or... I don't know. Those people are just celebrating. They're just like two busy smiling at each other. They have you on auto. They don't have to do anything. Allegedly. No, turn auto off and do it yourself to prove a point. Holy shit! <laughs> These people are gonna get so fucking sued. <laughs> Now that we accomplished that, we're all fired. <laughs> yeah, none of us want to be astronauts anymore. Thank you. <laughs> we were been there, done that. Yeah, Dude, please that tell sucks. me it just ends. It just ends right now with them landing and nothing after that. No prologue, no nothing. Or are we going to be five months later? No, yay! Holy Huntsville, shit, Alabama. Man. Boo! That was intense. Hey, starring Primus. Nice. Primus sucks. <laughs> no, Primus rules. So, uh, well, that's how you know you're not a real Primus fan if you say Primus is good. Don't you get uh, it? Yeah, I, know. I thought you actually meant it. You pat, you failed the test, poser. 
I well, love friends. give it up for all the hot ladies and uh, these these two or three loser kids. But again, that shit was fucking way intense for a kids movie. Yeah, I thought we were gonna be watching a stupid funny movie. This was like <laughs> that was like Gravity with kids. Uh, and that was yeah, lit. maybe that's why I didn't like the John Williams score. It made the movie too intense. I don't know. Definitely, that was way more than I expected, but it was pretty good. Pretty, was, pretty good. When I, was like, when I was like good, I mean, you know what I mean. I know I'm not going to fucking space anytime soon. Hell no. Like that. <laughs>